Hello YouTubers and welcome to my visual tutorial on how to make the female voice with Morphox Pro. I had a lot of you asking me how to show it visually um, and in this tutorial I will show you how to automatically fix the female voice because a lot of you have said that uh, you get the robotic voices and such and I will show you usually when you first install the female voices they will sound a lot like this and kind of robotic more like a little kid I understand this is what it used to sound like when I first started so what you want to end up doing is going to voice you know, <laughs> You want to go to voice learning, run voice. Sorry, that cut me off. Run voice doctor, and then go through that whole thing. And what it should end up doing, um, or actually, what you could end up doing is, um, if you already have voice doctor and some of the voices uh, configured, just click on it and click configure to voice, and then should automatically change the settings and hopefully it'll change it to you know be exact and perfect for you if not you can always play around with it I'll show you a few things so this is the default female it's not too bad uh, I do prefer my settings because this one's a little um, more heavy on the base then it is, uh, it just sounds like my voice is muffled. I don't know what it sounds like on your speakers, but with mine, it's definitely uh, bassy. So usually what I do is I put it at slider four on breathy. And then I take these, put it at general speech, sorry, default. Get down to here, and then bring this to 15. Let's do about 55. Sometimes, sometimes 50 to give it more of a, I guess, realistic sound. And remember again that what I'm doing is basically uh, meeting halfway changing somewhat of my voice I'm too shy to actually do it without the morph on because it just no offense but think of it as a sassy or male feminine way of talking a prissy kind of guy in a sense that's how you get the female voice. Otherwise, if I talk normal, it sounds a lot like this. It's just, nah, not that good. So, um... To continue, I had a few of you actually ask me how to do the android female and the female demon. So I'll show you those. The female android. Commander Shepard, you need it at the dock. Stuff like that. Um. So what you want is, of course, first the shift at five and the pitch shift at thirteen. Now, this isn't going to work for everybody, so you want to mess around with it. Try to get the uh, female voice. With these voice effects, it shouldn't be too difficult. And the one thing that you really want is strength to be at zero. Because if you have the strength up... Then it'll sound more like this. More of a... Oh, well, I don't actually know the word for it. So, that makes it easier for the to give it to that uh, female voice. You want to add default graphic equalizer. 
choose course, have course all the way at 10, and then in the middle for balance. Low cut, I prefer, I usually use this um, to give it more of a robotic sound. You want to add slider 4 on cut size and strength to be. I don't want to count that, but whatever. You see where it's at. It's four spaces from large. Hypertone, you don't have to have it anywhere up near perky. It just has to be normal pitch. Breathy has to be all the way at very soft. And then this one has to be all the way at max. That's pretty much it for the female android. You could always play around with it, try different ways. There's so many different kinds of combinations to make different sounding female androids. The female demon is not that different. Um, it's more or less you have to talk in a slower tone and more of a uh, dominatrix sort of way. The female demon. Let's see, you have to have it at shift 11, pitch shift 20. Like I said before, it can be different for everyone. You want the chorus to be at delay 5, slider 5, and the balance negative 2 from the middle or slider 4. Then you want breathy to be slider 3 for the softness level. Now I'm not exactly sure what graphic equalizer present preset this is, um, but you can just mock it. It's a plus 1 there, negative 2 here, and then negative four here, and then it's the same on the other side. Negative two and plus one. And these are default. <clears throat> so that's it for the female demon. Now, <clears throat> just because I have a little time left, I'll also show the other the uh, settings for Megatron. This one is negative 9, shift, pitch shift, negative 30. You want distortion to be at slider 4, intensity at slider 4 as well. You want phaser to be at, well, between slider 3 and 4. And then the strength to be at 4, at, sorry, 3. And that's it for voice effects. Now you can just mock the graphic equalizer. You went all the way down to negative 20, negative 20 here, plus 20 there, plus 8, plus 1, negative 1, 0, and then all three of these would be at plus 5. And that will give you the Megatron voice. Join the Decepticons. And I'll give you a cookie. Something like that. You also have to have somewhat of a growling voice. Um, for example, let's see. This is Megatron. And without Megatron, uh, yeah, morph. That's what it's. That's the voice you're supposed to have. Growling. So. Uh, uh, I also had somebody ask me about smog, but I'll have to show that in a different video because I'm running out of time. So thank you for watching. I hope this helped. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please do comment below. Subscribe, like, and have a wonderful day.